In today's tutorial, we're going to discuss how to merge or split PDF files in C Sharp using Iron PDF. All right, so in this video, we're going to talk about how to split and merge PDF files using the powerful Iron PDF library. We've already installed it here using the NuGet package manager. So let's go ahead and jump straight on into our program.cs file and check out the code. So first off, you need to import the Iron PDF namespace at the top of your file. Uh, next, we have a region tag that contains our license key. Uh, you would need to replace your license key with the license key you got when you purchased Iron PDF. So now let's take a look at the HTML strings that we have defined here, HTML A and HTML B. So here we're creating a simple HTML string representing two pages of a PDF document. So let's call that one HTML A. The div tag with the attribute page break after always uh, allows us to separate the content into different pages. And we do the same for the second two page PDF, which we'll call HTML B. So next we create an instance of the Chrome PDF renderer class. Uh, this class is responsible for rendering our HTML strings to PDF documents. Following that, we render our HTML strings to two separate PDF documents using the render HTML as PDF method. Once we have our two separate PDFs, we then merge them together using the static method PDF document dot merge. And the resulting merged PDF document is saved to our local C drive as merged.pdf. Next, we take our newly created merge.pdf document and we extract some pages from it. We extract the first page using the copy page method and save it as page one only.pdf. Then we extract pages two and three and save them as pages two to three.pdf. All right, so now let's run the project and see how it works. It might take a few moments uh, for this program to execute completely, so patience is always good. Great, so our project has finished running, so let's take a look at the output PDFs. Here's the merged PDF file. You can see that it's our four-page document as we expected. So next, let's open page one only.pdf. As you can see, it only contains the first page from our merged document. And finally, we open pages two to three.pdf, and you can see uh, the second and third pages only from our merged document. So there you go. Everything works exactly as expected. We hope that you found this tutorial helpful. And as always, if you are enjoying our tutorials or find them useful, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you'd like to experience the power of Iron Software firsthand, we also have a link to a trial description below in the description. And check it out for yourself.